ecology here and this is another world of tanks battle and i'm just gonna hop right into it so enjoy this battle and here we are and we're on himmelsdorf and i'm reviewing a match that my friend maglorian and his btsv sent in now this thing is a tier 3 troll mobile it is sloped to the wazoo so it automatically bounces most shells and it's gone <coughs> Excuse me. Is very, very good at this tier. Now let's see how he goes on this match. Looks like he's going over to Tink Alley. Um, passing everything in this. Very beautiful. I really want one. I really do. I wish I had 100 bucks to spend, but I don't. But I really want one. It's. Oh, uh, I really want one. But here we go, he's just being a troll, just not caring, not giving a care in the world, just driving around, going to go to the enemy side of the base, sees the AMX 1385, see, bounce, he already got a bounce, shooting, aims in, because he's like, okay, he needs to aim, using gold rounds, of course, because those are French, French tanks are very hard to penetrate, the Hopkiss 35 and the AMX 38. As he takes the shell damage, as he ta does more damage to that hot kiss or H35, and he tracks it. Next shot kills it. He it's now dead. Now he's going to shoot the AMX 38. Now that guy is pretty armored up to the wazoo as well because it's French. French low to your armor is pretty good. Now there's a Panzer 35T. That just poked out and then ran away because he's scared, which is hilarious. As his teammates tell him to fall back, but this thing don't need to fall back. We're listening to teammates. <laughs> now he shoots at it, 250 damage, and he has one last gold round. Fires his one last gold round, and now he's firing pure aim, armor piercing. Tries to penetrate the AMX, and he shoots the Panzer 35T. This thing has a very fast reload. I don't know why that keeps happening, but the French tank is now gone. Now the major obstacle in his way is now gone. Now he can take out the Panzer 35T without any problem. Now, oh, there's another French tank, the D2. It's another French tank, but it seems like he's not having any problem or much problem with this one as he was with the last one. As he takes shot after shot at the D2. Aims for the Commander's Cupola. Now he's going to rush over there to try to circle jerk him. Going very fast because this thing has a very fast speed. Uh, misses the shot. Backs away while reloading, making him pop out. And the D2 is now dead. Now he's on his way to the other side of the map. Or he's going to go back down. Nope, he's going to go after that medium 2. That medium 2 or 3 a medium three my bad that medium three no it's a medium two it was a medium two it looks like i couldn't tell on the mini map but there he is circling him as he takes fire after fire into his armor trying to not to get that medium two's gun on him misses that shell and he kills it the medium two is now dead now he's going to go back to base to stop the cap stop the enemies from capping as I fast forward this a bit. Da -da 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 and there we are as he comes up to our cap base. Now there's a cruiser Mark 1 over there. Aims in, fires, shoots, restarting the cap. Fires, aim, shoots. And one more shot and he got it. Four kills underneath his belt. Now there's one last tank, a Panzer 4 Alf A. A tier 3 Panzer 4. Let's see. Now he's going to zoom through the middle of the map, shoots randomly, and the match is over. And there you have it. Back to the garage we go. Or I'm going to sit here and talk about more of it since I don't have a BTSV in my garage. Now the BTSV is a very fun OP tank. It was initially a box set tank that you could buy for 100 bucks on the, I think, Russian, but 
you, it came with a bonus code for the BTSV. Now, for the special event this year, the Wargaming released this tank for 100 bucks. That also comes with 24,000 gold in the gift shop. I wish I had 100 bucks to spend so I can show you guys my battles of it, but I don't have one, sadly. But it's a very fun troll tank to play, as you see there. It took everything down. Granted, the French tanks did give it a little problem, but it's still all around a fun tank. And I hope you enjoyed that battle, and I'll see you in the next one. Ecology out. Bye-bye.